What's up geeks and gamers and welcome back to Gaming with Geeks. I'm Lethal Lightning and we might have some potentially really good news to do with the next generation of consoles and I think with everything going on around in the world these days we could use some good news especially when it comes to video games. So about, oh, it was about a month ago, maybe two months ago, we had uh, that really, really boring PlayStation 5 announcement where it just ended up being a whole bunch of specs and it was really boring. They kind of um, promoted it in a really bad way. But if that's in the past now, we're going to the future. And if this news is anything to be believed, then we might be getting an official announcement for both the Xbox One Series X and the PlayStation 5 sooner than expected. So let's jump into this. Xbox Series X, PS5 showcases coming sooner than expected, says analysis. Now that E3 2020 is no longer happening, an industry analysis claims that the Xbox Series X and PlayStation 5 may be fully revealed ahead of time. Now I've seen people talk about how this was always a possibility, both with the console announcements and potentially some game announcements because of course, you know, with the virus going around, um, E3 has been cancelled and apparently word was that Warner Brothers was going to have a really, really epic lineup. So fingers crossed about that. Okay, but anyway, now that everything from E3 to Gamescon has been cancelled, Microsoft and Sony are having to rethink how they go about the Xbox Series X and PlayStation 5, their first proper showings. So none of that tech talk, just the proper showings. On the bright side though, this could mean that these showings could come sooner than they would have had in a normal year. The two companies have been varying degrees in the forthcoming and recent months when it comes to their next generation consoles, with Microsoft showing off as much as the Xbox Series X itself, while Sony has so far only revealed the PS5 controller. We did cover the PS5 controller on the channel, so you can go back and have a look at that. It was generally assumed up until a few weeks ago that E3 would be where the consoles would get their first full reveals, but since E3's cancellation, there has been speculation that the companies would fill the void with digital events and some sort around the same time. Fingers crossed for that. However, industry analysis Daniel Ahmed claims that that won't be the case. In a tweet from earlier today, he talked about how a lot of the planned reveals and announcements for E3s are being rescheduled, with some slated to come much earlier while others will come much later. Although he didn't go into too much detail, he did add that the first proper next generation console slash games showcase is much earlier. This is really, really, really cool. And this does kind of go along with some of the news that was going around earlier about how Godfall, which is going to be uh, on the PlayStation 5, there's news that there might be news about Godfall in the very near future. So make sure you are subscribed to Gaming of Geeks because we'll keep you up to date with that type of stuff. It's April now and since E3 2020 was originally going to take place on June 9th to June 11th, Ahmed's claim of the much earlier could in all likelihood point to the first real glimpse of the next generation console taking place in mid to late May or around one month from now. This would fall around the time that a growing number of rumors are claiming that the Microsoft's host a proper console reveal for the Xbox Series X, so it's possible that Ahmed might be onto something here. That being said, he wrote up a follow-up tweet that nothing is set in stone for the next generation showcase just yet. He went on to say, we are living through an unprecedented situation and this is the one time where external factors such as the virus that's going around could actually change plans right at the last minute, he warned, but we will see. At any rate, it's clear that the typical rules for major video game related announcements aren't going to apply this year. I think that goes for just about everything this year, to be honest. <laughs> Anything can happen in the meantime, and that could mean that Microsoft and Sony may have to delay their plans for the next generation console. Here's hoping that won't be the case, though. So, what do I think about this? I think it's extremely likely that we could get an announcement sooner rather than later and I personally think that'll be the best way to go about it we kind of got to keep the hype going for these type of things you know because once the hype starts to slow down uh, you know you start to lose a little bit of money and unfortunately PlayStation 5 isn't doing the best when it comes to keeping their console hyped up Xbox Series X they're doing pretty good but to me it just seems that PlayStation is just really really lacking and that's why Microsoft's Xbox is looking so much better for the time being but We'll have to wait and see how this plays out, so drop your thoughts in the comment section down below. Let me know what you think about this. Be sure to subscribe to Gaming of Geeks. Leave a big thumbs up. Check out geeksandgamers.com. Stay safe, take care of yourself, and I'll see you all in the next video.